Hello Edmonton and happy December. Hard to believe that it is actually just a few days before Christmas. Uh, Rob Yastrzemski with RJ Holmes and EXP Realty here. Just wanted to uh, give everybody a quick update on uh, the market and what it's doing here this uh, this year. Uh, a lot of people think that December has no sales and other people are thinking, oh, the interest rates have increased, so therefore the house sales are way down. That is not at all the case. As a matter of fact, the smart bond money buyers see the opportunities in the marketplace because as we all know, when interest rates go up, the prices come down. And it sure looks like the interest rates are going to be holding firm. If not, they're going to actually maybe even drop in the new year. And when that happens, we all know that the house prices will start to climb. So right now, as it stands, just a quick snapshot of what has been happening in December so far. There's been a lot of sales. We've had in Edmonton, single family sales, 407 transactions. Um, last year, there was a little bit more. Of course, the interest rates were lower. So last year in December, there was 453. Um, now, that's for the Edmonton area. In Sherwood Park, this year, we've in December so far, we've had 25 sales. Last year, we had 28. So we're right on par. Um, and then uh, just some of the other areas around the Edmonton, uh, greater Edmonton area. St. Albert, um, last year, we had 33. This year? 25 and the month's not over yet um in beaumont beaumont last year we had in all of uh, the month of uh december we had 17 this year we're already at 18 uh spruce grove i just uh put up uh, some sold signs here for some clients of mine in spruce grove and we had a quick sale there this year we had so far for the month of december 18 last year we only had 17 um in Stony Plain, right next door. Last year, we had 10. This year, so far, we've got 8, and the month's not over yet. Um, and then Fort Saskatchewan also. Last year, we had a total of 26. This year, 21. So we're still on track to be on the same numbers as uh, last year. For So the interest rates have not discouraged buyers at all from uh, still continuing on making their purchases. Also, I just wanted to update you on the condos. Um, condos in the greater Edmonton area uh, are a, a little bit less active than uh, the single-family homes. However, that being said, if, if you uh, compare last year in Edmonton, we had a total of 264 transactions in December. This year, 239. Uh, that's just for the month of December. In Sherwood Park, we had uh, 15 last year for all of the month of December. This year, 14. Month's not over yet. St. Albert. Uh, similar story, we had 15 all of the last year for the month of December in St. Albert this year. So far, we've had 10 condo sales. Um, in Beaumont, we had zero in 2022 in December. This year, we've already had three. Um, Spruce Grove, last year we had five. This year, so far, six. Six sales, condo sales in Spruce Grove. Stony Plain, all of last uh, last year in twenty, uh, sorry, in December of 2022, we had five sales. This year, we are already at five, and the month's not over yet. Um, and then similar story for Fort Saskatchewan. Last year, we had a total of six condo sales in the month of December. This year, we've already got four. Month's not over yet. So, anyways, if you are thinking about making a move, whether it's sale or purchase, please don't hesitate. Give us a call rjhomes.ca. You can take a look at our website. You can call us direct at 780-222-8222. And all the wishing, wishing you all the very best to you and your family. Merry Christmas to all and Happy New Year. All the best in 2024.